Guys, I'm super happy that you clicked on this link. I'm super grateful. I'm... Yeah, I'm everything you can be. So what I'm gonna talk about in this video, I'm gonna talk about a little bit about myself. Like, during elementary school and pretty much how I grew up. And why I'm starting this business Get It Done brand as well. So please enjoy and another note. This is actually the first time using the camera at my face. And if you know that I'm a little bit insecure here and there, that's because it's my first time. So, once again, I'm super happy that you uh, click on this link right now. And please enjoy and let me know if something's bad. And I'm gonna correct it on my next video. Alright, enjoy guys! Alright guys, the little thing I want to let you guys know is... It's a little bit why I started Get It Done Brand. The whole thing started actually when I first entered like my fitness journey, uh, so to speak. I, I have always been interested in training. Uh, I played football when I was younger, soccer, uh, and went all right. But when I became a little bit older, younger, sorry, when I was younger, I, I thought to myself like, Damn, this is something I really want to do. I want to go for it, I want to become a pro, uh, so I train, I train, I train. Uh, but as, I, as the years went on, I noticed that everyone else in my, in my age, so to speak, uh, they all grew, they grew, they became bigger, stronger. And then it was me, I was really tiny, I was small, and uh, in every, every tackle, in every, some sort of near contact with, with people yeah, during, during matches, during training, I was like a flying glove. I couldn't stand a single tackle in, pretty much. So I decided like, I really need to do something with my body if I wanted to become a professional football player. I signed up with, at a gym uh, with my big brother and my twin brother, Alex and Anand. Uh, you're gonna meet Alex later on. And um, he took me to the gym. Uh, I went there for a couple of months and I really started to like it. I saw results pretty quick uh, and I liked the environment as well with the people, with, um, yeah, with the thing that we're all improving our bodies for the better. And uh, quickly realized that I wanted to become, I wanted to not become, but I wanted to do something with my body at a gym instead of a, on a football uh, pitch. So I continued training. Uh, I signed up at a new gym uh, where I lived at this. The first gym I joined well, a little bit far, further away from where I lived. Uh, so I signed up at a gym like three minutes from my house. I started to go frequently. I, I went pretty much not every day, but every second day. And I saw huge results pretty quick. And uh, as the time went by, my mindset got a little bit different. Like, like if, you, if you want something in life, you gotta go for it. And it doesn't matter what your your mom and dad says. I remember my dad, he started and he noticed the results of me, like that I'm getting a little bit bigger by the time. And I remember when he told me that, damn, you gotta stop doing this. And so he told me like, damn, you gotta step away from the weights a little bit, take it, take it easy. But in my opinion, I was like, this is exactly what I want to do with my life. And uh, this is something where I want to grow my name in. And uh, I still haven't grown in, in, in my name in it, but I'm still working towards it. Still want to become something in fitness, uh, fitness industry. And, um, so yeah, but the philosophy about Get It On Brand was later on when I started Instagram, I felt like I need to come up with a pitch. With a pitch, like something that would uh, that people could recognize me with. And I started with, uh, randomly I thought to myself in my head, like, get it done. Get it done sounds pretty cool. So I started to write that on every picture I posted. Uh, get it done, get it done. And uh, as I met my friends uh, at the gym or in school or on the street, it didn't matter. They all came up to me like, ah, here's the get it done guy, here's the get it done guy. Uh, something around get it done. And I noticed that it started to, people started to see it. People started to know saying that they could see my hashtag and uh, they could see my philosophy behind it. Like, I really wanted to get this done. I really wanted to 
improve my body, I wanted to be, become bigger and they saw the results as well. So later I started to realize like if I could do this at the gym, why can't I do this when it comes to making my family relationship better? The last meal in for the day, late at night, uh, get up early uh, in all those aspects of life. Like, why can't we all just get up the, the energy we put in the gym? Why can't we put that energy in anything in life? Like if we, we're freaking awesome if we can get things done in the gym, that's massive. The gym isn't everything. And uh, yeah, we, we get things done in the gym, but we can also get things done outside the gym. And this is what I want to push on. Like, I want to motivate people because people always say stuff like, oh, I, next year I'm gonna start training and next year I'm gonna find a dream a girl or dream guy and and when the, when the year comes nothing happens and so this is something I want to push on like this is why I want to start this brand get it done brand where I want to evolve all of you guys with me like I want to show you guys everything is possible I'm just at the start of my journey and uh, I'm super excited. I haven't done, to be honest, I haven't done a lot of things in my life to to have you guys follow me on. But I see we all gotta start somewhere. Uh, it doesn't matter if we want to improve our bodies or if we want to improve our lives overall. We gotta start. We gotta get it done. So yeah, now we got a little bit deep, but this is. This is big for me, I really like the concept behind it, and uh, yeah, wow. can't wait to show you guys more. I want to, I want all of you to join me on this, on this big trip, and uh, it's gonna be so much fun. Wow. Alright, I'm gonna meet up with my brother later on, can't wait for you guys to meet him. He's a great guy, I love him. Alright, gonna wait for these eggs to boil up. We got, let's see how many. Next week, oh, one minute left. Alright, guys, here we go. Turn it up there, and we're gonna turn it off as well. <laughs> 